guys, welcome to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today I'm excited to unbox the all new Bugatti Veyron Grand Sport. Now, this RC car was created by Rostar, a company that makes a lot of great RC cars, in which this was sent by TomTop.com, a company that sells a lot of great products such as this one right here. So for your very own, check out their link down below in the description. Now, this particular RC car costs under $30, which is a great value, especially for a car that fully functions and looks like a model-worthy car as well. So, I'm really excited to go ahead and try it out, but before we do, let's go ahead and unbox this thing. Alright, so this here's our packaging in which it says Bugatti Veyron on the top. Uh, you do see the car kind of peering through the casing itself, which looks really nice. Uh, as we work our way around the box itself, on the back here you do see some pictures of Bugatti Veyrons kind of racing on a track. Uh, on the bottom here it talks about it in terms of details on what you need uh, technically wise. So you need 5 AA batteries to make this car work, as well as a 9 volt battery for the remote. So do keep that in mind when you purchase this. So let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see what it looks like underneath. Alright, so you do see our car just kind of sitting right here in our remote as well. Uh, underneath it, you do see there's an instruction manual or a quick start guide, as well as an antenna that hooks onto the remote itself. Uh, so the way you open this is simply just twisting these caps just like this, and then the car should just pop right up. There you go. Alright, so this is everything that it comes with. We get a very basic controller with the forward, reverse, left and right. Uh, you got the Bugatti Veyron logo in the center, as well as the 9-volt uh, battery pack that goes in the back. Now the car itself looks really neat. Uh, a few things that I kind of just noticed going from the back to the front is that you do get a nice looking center exhaust. The taillights look really neat as well. You got the Bugatti logo right over here. Uh, you do see a nice looking engine bay down to the details. And it's actually really high quality. Now the wheels itself are made out of a nice rubber compound in which you do see a caliper kind of mounted with the rotor. So it's actually pretty interesting on how they designed that. Now working our way forward you do see a nice looking interior in which there's actually a lot of different details from the stitching into the center of the console uh, down to the gauges itself, it's actually really authentic. Now as we work our way to the front, uh, we got a nice looking grille in the front here as well as the headlight housing, this is actually really authentic. Uh, the color combination is really neat and it's actually got a very nice high gloss finish to it in which it's actually a very model worthy piece that looks really neat just kind of sitting the way it is, not to mention it's an RC car. <laughs> So we're all set and ready to go. In terms of the control, you have forward, reverse, left and right. Literally when you hit forward, the headlights will go on. And then when you hit reverse, the taillights will go on. And this kind of gives you an idea of how the LEDs work. Now the way it controls is actually, uh, literally it's got some wide turning stance as you can probably notice right there. Uh, and what I kind of realized is if you just go ahead and decelerate and turn, it will kind of give you more of a sharper angle. But overall, it's a very basic RC car in terms of functionality goes. Uh, it's pretty quick for what it is. But, whoops. <laughs> and it does take a beating as you can probably tell right there. But overall, it's a very high quality piece and definitely very unique to nonetheless. And now with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions about the Bugatti Veyron, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you again for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.